free. This one's the WWE champions. Pay to win like every day, yeah. I don't play ball games. Funny how they still think I'm a broke man. Then I'm broke. Even though I be pulling Hogan. Me. I spent like 40 grand on a couple thousand pictures of some sweaty men. The hype is real. The seethe is real. Because as you know, I have an insane group of obsessed detractors who just absolutely hate anything positive at all in my life, correct? And in this case, since I announced yesterday that I'm getting a new gaming PC arriving today as donated by a viewer, uh, they can't handle it. Again, anything good happening to me is like the end of the world to them. So, of course, they've gone on a drama palooza trying to explain away, oh, the PC's not going to be any good. And uh, Phil, obviously, he's a liar. You know, he's done all this. Phil's such a liar. He bought that Victrix joystick, and he bought this new webcam, and he bought this new PC. And it's like, number one, even if I did, isn't that a good thing because I'm using money towards my business? But I'm telling you right now, I haven't. This is all donated stuff. I'm being honest with you. And number two, what does that even mean? Oh, well, see, it means that Phil doesn't need any money. He doesn't need any, any contributions because he's rich. Wait a minute. I thought your argument was that every dollar that I make on stream, I waste on mobile games. So where did all the money come from to buy all this stuff, geniuses? Right? It's like, this is what I mean. The, everything they say is bullshit, and they only spin it towards whatever their narrative is today. And once the narrative makes no sense and falls apart, it's a new narrative tomorrow. So where exactly is the phantom money appearing from and coming from? And where is it going? And how am I? It, like, think about this. Supposedly, I've spent hundreds of thousands of dollars on mobile games. But now, magically, out of thin air, I have money for all of it. What, did I win the lotto? You know, what are you talking about? <clears throat> but again... There's no logic behind anything that they say. They make it all up to be negative about me as much as they possibly can. And again, it's called seething. They're seething over any possibility of, of positivity around me, okay? Um, it just makes no sense what they say or do. Now, in reality, I've just had a big stroke of luck. You know, this year, let's be honest. This year has been a very positive year, right? Successful launch of a throwback channel. Is it huge? No, but it's it's doing decently. People are enjoying it. I'm enjoying it. We've got a weekly show on there that I stream that's great. Multiple playthroughs that are being restored that are awesome. It's working. It's a good channel, right? We've got massive improvements to my setup that everyone is enjoying. Better quality videos, better quality, you know, webcam, uh, you know, audio I've improved. Everything this, this year I have improved, right? And what's starting to happen is finally... The opinion is turning against the detractors who for so long had it their way where all anyone heard about DSP was something toxic, negative, and a meme that was a negative thing. Well, now you've got people who are negative memesters and commentators who are actually looking at the real me and saying, oh shit, he's actually not that bad. Everyone's been full of shit all along. Like the Kino Casino guys, right? And they can't handle that. People cannot handle that who hate my guts because again, there's an entire cult of people who over the last 10 years have actually made it their existence on the internet to hate Phil. It means that you need to ruin my life, ruin my family's lives, harass us at every turn, try to do as much as you can to hurt not only me, but my business and everything else around me, make as much slander and bullshit up as possible, and keep propagating it as if it's fact when it's not. And they have actually created entire communities around discords and friendships and things just around shitting on me for no good reason. They are pathetic losers. They have no lives. That's why they do this. If they had positive lives, they would never need to be toxic individuals. You understand that? So <clears throat> the fact that now good things are happening to me is like the worst possible scenario for them. They can't handle it. And they are exploding and see they're, they're mass messaging me. They're mass messaging Kino Casino guys, they're mass messaging everybody. Ooh, 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 ooh. They even, just yesterday, get this, 
on this podcast, I announced I'm going to be getting a PC donated by a viewer. They went and mass messaged the Kino Casino guys, why did you buy DSP a PC? They're like, what? What the fuck are you talking about? We didn't buy him a PC. Were you crazy? Yeah, they are. Like, that's the best explanation. They're nuts. <laughs> like, what the fuck would they make that association? I haven't even appeared on their show yet. And you think they bought me a several thousand dollar PC? <clears throat> They're so dumb. All right. But anyway, um, all right, my trolls right now are basically activating a new campaign. Yes, I know that sounds disturbing because it is. They want people to actually believe that I have bought all of this equipment recently, that I bought this webcam, that I bought this Victrix joystick, that I bought this PC that's arriving. Why? Do they want you to think that? Because they want you to think that I'm rich and that I basically have been hoarding money for ages, all right? And that you don't need to support my content. Like, literally, that's what they're saying now. They're posting it all over. See, he has all this money all along. You don't need to support Dark Side Phil. Don't support Dark Side Phil, okay? I'm sad that I have to bring it up, but I hope that you would understand this is bullshit. My streams run as normal. Every stream, I look to raise 50 bucks in tips. If I get anything additional, like Super Chats, memberships, that's great. And this is how I operate my business, okay? No, I'm not rolling in dough magically and can afford all this stuff. It's literally all being donated to me. And I'm so appreciative, appreciative of this. It's going to help to set up so much. Street Fighter VI, I'm going to be playing the absolute best version. All games coming forward. I'm going to be playing amazing graphical versions of these games with no input delay, right? It's going to be awesome. And I'm very excited for this, and I'm very grateful. But I hope this doesn't backfire. And now people are like, oh, see, now Phil has all this stuff, so screw him. He doesn't need any support. It's the opposite. This is my job. You know, this is literally all equipment showing up for my job for me to make better content for you. So I hope you will continue to please support. I don't want to bring this up constantly all day. I don't. But I feel like I have to because literally you have a bunch of assholes coming out and saying this. It's like it's completely untrue. They just want to hurt me again. They're angry that I am having a streak of good fortune, right? So now, because they're angry about that, now they want to turn it into a negative for me. So let's get Phil's viewers to think that he's rich and rolling in dough so that they won't support his streams anymore, okay? So, yeah, do you want to know the truth? I'm nervous about that shit because there's some people who just believe anything, and that's sad. You know, we have regular viewers who come by, and all of a sudden I find out, oh, they talked to a detractor, now they hate me. I didn't even do anything. I'm just making the same content. I haven't changed. I'm the same dude. And now they hate me all of a sudden. And I get nervous about this shit because, you know, I love you guys. I want to hang out with you. I want to keep making content. I don't want to get a new PC. And now for two weeks, I have two of the slowest weeks I've ever had on stream because people think I'm rich. I, I'm not. You know, I just understand this is definitely a gift from someone, a very generous gift. And I'm appreciative of it, but I hope that it doesn't backfire. You know what I mean? Like, yes, today, this is a cause for celebration. This is something that's going to massively improve my setup and is going to make my content much better moving forward. It's something we have talked about for the longest time is having a gaming PC. And now it's finally coming to fruition. All that anticipation and hype is finally happening, right? I don't want this to now turn into, oh, now Phil can't pay his bills because, of it, you know? As I said, we easily could have done a fundraiser to do something like this ages ago. And I didn't do that. What is the reason of that? I told you. Because I know that my fans are already very generous. My fans already support my stream so much that if I did a fundraiser to get a PC, they absolutely would support it. But then they'd be like, well, sorry, now I can't help you for the next month because I gave you everything I got so you can get your PC. So that's why I never did a fundraiser to do something like this. Someone now going out of their way and doing it out of the kindness of their own heart is very much appreciated. But now I'm nervous. And so I hope this doesn't come to fruition. I hope that people will still come by and hang out and support the streams. Because, yeah, it does make me very nervous. Uh, but with the, all the nasty shit that's said about me literally every single day, it makes, me, it makes me nervous and upset that morons might do toxic stuff towards me. Okay? Okay. <clears throat> An incredibly generous $50 tip this morning. From D-Man, he says, your detractors lost all accountability. They've been peddling for years. At this point, 
You spend all of your tip money on mobile games, extravagant dinners. Now they're saying you somehow bought an expensive car, but they can't explain how you'd be able to pay bills if you're insanely blowing out all of your money. Obviously, it's clear they won't stop until you're homeless. That's their sick goal. Congrats on the new PC and allow me to reach your goal for your first stream. Thank you. The D-Man for a $50 tip. I appreciate that very, very much. Yeah, I. you tell me because, again, <clears throat> their narrative only works to a certain extent because I won't entertain it, correct? So now I've just stayed silent and said, whatever, you say whatever you want for years. Now the narrative doesn't seem to work anymore if, it, if everything they're saying is true. So it's like either they're wrong or they're wrong. There's no situation where they can actually be right. Right? There's no way that with the money that I make on my streams that I could be buying a car, buying a PC, buying a webcam, buying a Victrix joystick, and then spending hundreds of thousands of dollars on mobile games. It can't happen. So the narrative is flawed. It never was true. It's shit that they've been fabricating for years on their own bullshit. They circle jerk themselves so hard in their circles of bullshit that they just believe the bullshit. They forget that this could be true, but it's circumstantial. This could be true or it could be completely fabricated, but we have no evidence either way. So we'll just assume it's true. They forget that because they just want to believe. If you want to believe something, it doesn't matter how much you are presented evidence to the contrary, you'll still believe it. You understand? So there's no point. So I just sat here and said, I'm just going to be quiet and do my own thing and let them destroy themselves. And now they're getting to the point, they've, they've pretty much done it, right? Like they don't have an argument anymore. How could you say all this stuff is true? It doesn't even make any fucking sense. Make it make sense. Did I win the lotto? Do you have evidence I won the fucking lotto? That'll be the next thing. We found evidence Phil won the lotto. Sh sure, go find that too. Go for it. And then they'll believe it, right? <clears throat> <laughs> They're so stupid. You got some idiot named DSP who's a total piece of shit, by the way. I like to I like to get that on YouTube.